MLB Network is your exclusive home for postseason baseball. Game two of the World Series. Forrest Whitley is on the mound for game two. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, man, we're going to get a chance to look at a good veteran pitcher here. This guy's been around the block a few times, but one of the things he does, he still competes at a high level, and he's never stopped trying to learn how to be a good pitcher. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field, and it's gone. solo shot here to left center field his first homer so far in the series and that will break the seal early here it's quickly one to nothing what a way to get things started while playing on the road top of the first and a big fly just like that they take the lead it's not the end of the world if you do you still need to make a quality pitch Throws him for strike three, and that retires the side. But they're off to a good start as they pick up a run on this solo shot. Brett Hill will be on the bump for game two of the series. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, we're going to get a chance to look at a guy that uh, is a little bit up and down throughout points of his career. A career ERA just over four. When he's good, he can what happened right there. And when we say inside half of the baseball, imagine the ball coming to a complete stop halfway between home. And the center fielder is under it to make the catch, and the inning is over. Oh, right back to him on the mound. There's one. Relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. So no runs on one base hit, no errors. And that's a base hit in the center field. And the tying run comes around to score from second. It's one to one. We're talking about coming up with a big knock. After that pop up, it looked like the inning was potentially over. Big two out base hit to drive in a run. Yeah, you watch your teammate in front of you miss his pitch. He got a nice. Comes set. The 0 1. Line toward right center. And this is down for extra bases, and with two out, this might get them both home. And the runner will score from second. And a relay home, and he is in there. Let's take another look at just a textbook swing right there. Good weight transfer, good hands to the ball, solid contact, and great extension through the ball. Yeah, that's about as pretty as a swing gets. Nice look at it there from our camera guys as well. The plate, Joe Rizzo, as he swings and grounds it toward the hole. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And he's out. Beautiful throw home to cut down the run. So they pick up three runs on five base hits. No errors. And one man left on base. Pitch is out of the strike zone. But I think he's caught out of their game a little bit right now. Two. This is skied into short left center. To Cheeky is there and he'll put it away to retire the side. Outs. The 1 1 home. Ground ball left side. And that's through into left to base hit. Now the throw comes quickly into the third baseman, so they're at the corners now to begin the inning. Hey, this has the makings of being a pretty big inning. The row leadoff double, now a base hit, and all the you know, taking you inside the mind of a batter right here. You can't get an auto swing mode. You still have to control the strike zone. Into the box now, Travis Moore. He reached on a single in his first try. He's got it, and he'll go the short way to retire the side. It from the left side right here. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Backdoor breaking ball the other way. Fires me up. Stepping in now, Ezra Montalvo. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. 3-1 count and you get a fastball 
those are the ones you really want to punish. Couldn't get the bat on it, so we'll see if that comes back to haunt him. Back up the middle. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Dan, if they're going to crack Drew, this has got to be the opportunity they've been looking for right here. They've had a ton of hits, a ton of people on base. Another 1-2 delivery. And this is on the ground to first. Could be two. On the first, it's a double play. And another crisis is averted here as the inning is over. So they pick up no runs on two hits, no errors, and one man left on. To the There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing it. And if not, it's ball four anyways. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Oh, Matt, a base hit here changes this game quite a bit. But if they can't score here, it looks... Hold on now. That ball is down and could score a run. But not in time as the run scores and the lead is trimmed to one. Dan, with that single, he's now three-quarters of the way to hitting for the cycle. Toughest one still on the shelf, though. He's got to get a triple. Yeah, that's your set at zero. That's one of those that's either got to hit any gap or find one down the line. Maybe he can do it in. He'll hit pretty well out to deep left field. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. So it's a run on three hits, no errors, and two men left on. The eighth, coming forward, the veteran outfielder, Cesar Pina. Now he gets the inning started with a bang as this is hit high and deep to left field. That one is out of here. This game is tied. A solo shot here to left, and we are tied again. to love the World Series. What a game we have right now. Home run ties it late. Place is going absolutely bananas. Would you rather be anywhere else? Looking for more here. Got him swinging. Made him chase outside the zone that time, and that puts an end to the inning. So they... Flair out toward right center. And there's a base hit. So just like that, the leadoff man's aboard representing the potential go-ahead run. At the plate, oh, Joe Rizzo. He's running. Pitch swung out and missed the throw. Not in time. He's in there at second. Well, when the stolen base is that close, it's interesting to check it out on show track. And as the numbers come in, you'll want to focus on the top speed. Really good, and it paid off there. It's way the 0 1 pitch. The 1 2. Now a swing, and this ball is crushed straight away center field. Gone! And that two run home run delivers an eighth inning lead. Shot to straightaway center and is now five to three. This is going to be one of those moments we look back on in a couple years when we relive this World Series. That swing of that late in the game to take the lead. Huge win. You could tell he picked the spin up of that breaking ball right out of the pitcher's hands. He had perfect timing, just missed it. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Well, we've seen some really good pitching from these guys in this one. The bullpen has looked sharp and have backed up a nice effort turned in by the Drilled on the ground to short. Fielded cleanly. On to first, and they're an out away. Two gone here in the ninth. In excess of 37,000 come to their feet. A curveball hit right back at him. Throw on to first is in time to get him. And the Astros have held serve here at home. They take games one and two of this series as this one is over. Hey, it always feels good to win a baseball game, but when you can win one at home in front of your home crowd, all those fans cheering, this is a good win for this team.